make way, please? Can you make way, please? They're calling her the ant from hell and the antichrist. Why? Because she sued her 12-year-old nephew. It looks terrible. It's terrible. Can you imagine what will happen at the next family dinner? Right. Thanksgiving's Auntie coming Jen up. It happened when Jennifer Connell arrived at her nephew's eighth birthday party at his house in swanky Westport, Connecticut. That's when the little boy, whose identity we're protecting, leaped into her arms, saying, Auntie Jen, I love you. And she falls backward and falls on her wrist breaking it. She was suing for more than $127,000 worth of damages. That was four years ago, but yesterday Connell's wrist was still wrapped in a brace as she left court. Connell lives in this walk up on the Upper East Side. When she took the stand, she said her injury was so bad she had trouble holding a plate of hors d'oeuvres at a recent party. But the jurors apparently didn't appreciate the fact that an aunt was suing her little nephew. It took them just 25 minutes to reach a verdict and sent the aunt home without a penny. We just couldn't find them, um, you know, liable for what happened. This is one of the jurors. No, he wasn't. This is Steve, a dolphin. The little boy, Sean, shown here in videos posted online, looked perplexed when he sat in court. To compound the family drama, the boy's mother, Lisa, passed away suddenly just a year ago. Jennifer Connell now finds herself the target of a heap of abuse for suing the boy. He loved his aunt, and this woman threw his love back in his face, goes one comment. I think it's crazy. I'm a parent and an auntie, so um, boy, all you ever want is your kid to run in your arms, whether they knock you over or, or not. The drama continued as the aunt was driven away from court. The aunt's lawyers say our client was very reluctant to pursue this case, but in the end, she had no choice but to sue the minor defendant directly to get her bills paid. Her hand was forced by the insurance company. Connell insists she loves her nephew.